Trent Alexander-Arnold has made a statement his future with the England national team lies in midfield. In a recent match against Malta, Alexander-Arnold showcased his skills and stole the show with a remarkable goal. Although the opposition may not have been the strongest, his performance was exceptional and deserving of recognition on a bigger stage. The Liverpool player's goal was a powerful strike from almost 25 yards out, leaving the goalkeeper with no chance. It was a display of his talent and creativity. Alexander-Arnold also played a key role in setting up England's first goal, demonstrating promising chemistry with his teammate Buke Osaka. This performance has sparked a debate about Alexander-Arnold's position on the field. While he has primarily been a right-back, there is now a tantalizing prospect of him forming a midfield trio with Jude Bellingham and Declan Rice. Alexander-Arnold himself has expressed his comfort in playing in midfield and sees it as a natural fit for him. However, this is not the first time Alexander-Arnold has been asked to play in midfield for England. In a World Cup qualifier against Andorra, he was used in midfield but faced criticism from his club manager Jurgen Klopp. This time, though, Alexander-Arnold's performance has silenced the debate. The role of an inverted right-back slash midfielder allows Alexander-Arnold to start in a defensive position and move forward. England manager Gareth Southgate sees the potential in this position for Alexander-Arnold and has spoken to him about it. Southgate wants to give him the freedom to create and believes he can excel in midfield. While there are still aspects of the midfield role that Alexander-Arnold is learning, such as receiving the ball in tight areas and defensive awareness, he is intelligent and adaptable. The next step for him is to be tested against stronger teams to truly gauge his abilities. With his creativity and threat going forward, it is clear that Alexander-Arnold should no longer be seen as just a right-back. Both his club and country recognize his potential in midfield. The debate has ended, and it is time to embrace this new chapter in Alexander-Arnold's career. But of course, there are skeptics who argue that his performance against Malta should not be overhyped. They believe that he still has a long way to go to prove himself against stronger opposition. It remains to be seen how he will fare in future matches. Regardless of the debate, Trent Alexander-Arnold has shown glimpses of his potential in midfield. Only time will tell if he can consistently perform at this level and establish himself as a key player for both Liverpool and the England national team.